This conference okay. will now be recorded. Okay, guys, a very warm welcome to this Microsoft System Center Configuration Manager online training session. First of all, I would like to introduce myself. My name is Carl. Practical IT experience. I have trained more than my voice clear to you. Are you able to hear me, everyone, properly? Yes, sir. I can hear your voice. Okay. Good. So, my name is Kashif. I am from India. I have uh, 13 years of practical IT experience. I have expertise on SCCM, Intune, Active Directory, Application Packaging, Azure, PowerShell. I am a BSc IT graduate. I did my graduation from Mumbai University and later on I started working as a system administrator. I worked in level one team, level two, level three. And now my primary roles and responsibility is to work on uh, SCCM designing and implementation. So I'm working as SCCM architect. So my primary roles and responsibility is to implement SCCM in companies. I have implemented uh, SCCM in more than 40 companies so far. So I have uh, trained more than 8,000 students globally. So that's about me guys. I am going to take you to the next slide. Now the training duration is going to be for 35 hours. Monday to Friday. One and a half hour session we will do. On daily basis Monday to Friday. And it's going to take four weeks to finish all the topics. Okay. That's the weekdays schedule. Okay. Total 35 hours. Now let's talk about the SCCM historical details. When this product started, what all versions of this product released so far. So basically SCCM was not SCCM before it was SMS. This is the old name of SCCM. SMS is what system management server. So SCCM uh, released uh, the first version of SMS was released in the year 1994. Then in 1999 SMS 2.0. Then in 2003 SMS 2003. Then Microsoft changed the name in the year 2007 and they released SCCM 2007, then SCCM 2012, then SCCM 1511. 15 is year and 11 is month. You, you see 15, 2015 and November. These are the three versions released in the year 2016. These three versions released in the year 2017. These three versions released in the year 2018. These three versions released in the year 2019, but from 1910, it is no more SCCM. They changed the name from SCCM to MECM. Microsoft Endpoint Configuration Manager. So SCCM is now MECM, Microsoft Endpoint Configuration Manager from 1910 last year. And this year they have released 2002 in the year 2020. This is in 2020, February. You see, 02 is February and 20 is the year. So that's the new name of SCCM MECM Microsoft Endpoint Configuration Manager 2002. So it is the latest, latest and greatest version of SCCM. So as you see, it started from 1994 and now the latest version is this. 
so almost like 25 years this product is there in Hello? Lost the audio. Hey you guys hello yeah it's, it's audible Sorry. okay so where did i lose you guys 25 years yeah 20 it is there in for the past 25 years any questions so far anyone hmm also so it's a matured so product yeah so is it having the same features now uh, after in 2020 after changing the name again uh, all the same features it had before not same feature but same architecture same uh, yeah. uh, you know same design but uh, they have added some more features in the new one okay so installation installation all the same or any difference in same 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 okay this was the exam code but that is expired now okay 70-703 so we are waiting for new exam to come once it is available then you can take that exam so that's the certification details now, if you are looking for SCCM related opportunities, then SCCM is uh, SCCM basically holds somewhere around 43% of market share. Okay, so people who are working on SCCM profile, they earn somewhere around 45 US dollar per hour. Those in India can expect a salary of 800 indian rupees 800000 indian rupees per year that's the average salary okay uh, you may be getting more you may be getting less than this but that's the average salary for sccm administrator so it's a big uh, number 43% it's uh, that means almost all big size companies and medium size companies have SCCM. Okay, you may not find SCCM in uh, small size companies, but big size and small size companies have SCCM. So um, there are competitors of SCCM like hcl big fix previously it was ibm big fix now it is hcl big fix then land desk then you have tanium all trace but sccm is leading the market on the top and 43 percent of market share okay so the if you talk about the opportunities in SCCM, so SCCM is like evergreen. Okay, you have uh, uh, SCCM related opportunities almost everywhere around the globe. 
so you don't have to worry about this uh, product then uh, sites in SCCM there are three sites central primary and secondary we will discuss these things later on not now what are sites in SCCM what are the site roles in SCCM okay So there are features uh, and functionalities of SCCM. Um, give me one minute. So these are the uh, basic features of SCCM asset management like you can collect hardware and software inventory right asset intelligence to categorize software software metering is to uh, find out the utilization of any software you can deploy application through sscm you can deploy updates operating system content management you can find out how many computers are compliant non-compliant power management to deploy a power policy client health to see the healthiness of the client endpoint protection uh, mobile device management then you have a role based administration uh, remote management reporting monitoring these are common features of sccm okay then if we do the training in the training you all will have to set up your sccm lab either you do it on local laptop okay or desktop so for that you need to have 12 gigabyte of ram quad core processor 300 gb of ssd hard drive if you do not have this configuration then you can go on Azure Cloud Data Center that gives you 30 days free trial. Okay. 30 days free trial and wherein you ha can have one computer and uh, you know from that computer you can remotely connect to these computers in the cloud. We will set up everything in the Azure Cloud and remotely connect to our cloud computers. So that is the lab setup information guys and lab architecture will be like this we will have one network and uh, on that network we will have four virtual machines so out of four virtual machine three will be windows server and one will windows client computer this one will be windows 10 and on this we will be installing deploying application updates uh, all the things we will be doing on this box any question guys anyone uh, so regarding this mobile device management uh, like what are the uh, uh, things we'll do in that mobile device management basically mobile device management is uh, to manage your android iphone ios devices so through mm -hmm. that you can manage your mobile devices like you can send policies you can format your uh, mobile uh, like this intune intune yes basically we do it through intune itself okay 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 because we have this uh, intune setup in our uh, you know on-prem uh, setup hmm. i thought it's from the azure side it's a part of Azure, but it's a Microsoft product itself and uh, okay. for managing but mobile devices. Okay, but we are going to manage this from... Uh, from uh, no, SCCM, no, no, no. Right? Previously, we used to manage it from SCCM. I mean, okay. Intune, we used to integrate Intune in SCCM, but now they have stopped it and it is a separate product, uh, which mm -hmm. you can subscribe and manage your mobile devices. Okay. Okay.
Azure. Sir, what is Azure? Azure is a public data center. You can uh, create your Azure subs subscription and create your uh, resources in uh, that cloud data center. Okay. Okay. Uh, okay. Any question, guys? Before we wrap it up, so what will be the timings for the classes? Morning, six o'clock. Uh, six o'clock uh, EST. Yeah. Uh, that we need to check it, sir, because uh, uh, okay, you it'll be four thirty. Yeah, it'll be four thirty in UAE. Okay, we we can change the time. That's not a problem. Uh, today, today. But seven seven a.m. is okay for me. Uh, okay, today I will update to Sampath, and then uh, Sampath will let you know about it. Okay, I need to I need to go on to the session now. My session is starting now, so. Uh, if you have any further question, you can ask Sampath and Sampath will get back to you. Okay. okay. Thank you. Okay. Hello. Thank you guys for joining the session. I hope the session was informative and we'll meet again. Thank you. Bye-bye. Thank you so much. Bye. Thank you.